Hey guys, in today's video, I wanted to show you how you can connect your Android tablet to your Windows PC or laptop. So I'm using a Samsung Galaxy tablet and I'm running Windows 10 on my computer. This will also work with Windows 11. Okay, so to do this, we want to open up a web browser and then go to a website called spacetest.net. I'll put it in the description below. Once you're on this website, you want to scroll down to here and you want to install the base test driver software for your primary PC. So this one here is my primary PC or your laptop. And then for me, I have a 64 bit computer. Most new computers are 64 bit and I have Windows 10. So this one's for Windows 10 and Windows 11. It does have a copy for Windows 8.1 as well if you have an older computer. Make sure you read down here if you have a NVIDIA graphics card. Just want to read this information down here if you have any issues. So for me, I'm going to go click on this one and that's just going to download it to my download folder. I can click on here and show all. And so now it's here in my downloads. I can click on that. And then we just want to go through the installation process. So we're just going to go next and then accept the terms. Um, this is where it's going to save it. And you're going to need to add an exception on your Windows firewall for space test. Um, so you'll need to go to your antivirus software on your computer, or if you use the Windows firewall one, you'll need to do that directly on your computer. Next and install and then we'll go finish. Okay, so once that's installed, it should be in your recently added or somewhere in your program files. Just look for space desk driver console. We wanna click on that. And then in here you can see the console. Once you have the console installed on your computer, then you need to install the other half on your tablet. So to do this, um, you just wanna to go to the Play Store and then search for Space Desk Display Monitor and then install that one. Okay, so now that's installed, I'm just gonna click open on the app. So this is just telling me that you need to install the Space Desk Driver Console on the computer first, which we've already done, so I can go okay. So down the bottom here, it's looking for a LAN or Wi-Fi connection. I'm just gonna turn that off because I wanna use a cabled connection. I don't wanna do a wireless connection. So now I just wanna grab my cable. I'm gonna plug one end into my computer and the other end into my tablet. Once you're on your tablet, you just want to swipe down from the top and then click on USB file transfer. So you need to make sure you're on transferring files. And so now we're going to jump back onto the computer. Um, so under communication interface, we want USB cable driver. And then we're going to come back down to our tablet. Um, and if it doesn't connect straight away, you just want to unplug it and then re-plug it in. I'm just go OK. And then we just want to open Space Desk to handle USB. OK, so now you can see that we're connected down here. And so I can even grab this, uh, this window up here and I can bring it down onto my tablet. So once this is all set up, I like to just minimize this. I'm gonna right click onto my computer desktop background and go to display settings. You can see up the top here, number one is my big monitor here and number two is my tablet. So I'm gonna put number two below like this because that's how they're set up here. But if you have your second monitor off to the side, you can put it over here or over here. Okay, so then I'm gonna apply and then close it. And so now you can see like if you wanted to bring anything, it's straight down instead of going off to the side. So it just makes it easier when you're moving things around. So now we can open up a Google browser and we can bring it down here and we can click on here and type. Does it do touch screen? Yes, we do have touch screen. Um, obviously it's gonna be pretty tricky with the touch screen because it's so tiny, um, but you can do it. There we go. So the latency seems pretty good. 
yeah, like it seems pretty responsive, so that's good. Okay, so I'm gonna pop a YouTube video down here. Let's see when we click on a video. Okay, so the first thing we wanna do is if you have- uh, So that is playing audio, let's pause that. It's playing audio through the tablet speakers. Let's see if we can change that. So if we come over here to our speakers, we can see we've got Space Desk Virtual Speaker. And so that's playing through my tablet. I'm just gonna change it to, I don't have any other speakers, I'm just gonna change it to my monitor speakers. And then we're gonna hit play on that video. And you'll just turn that on to connect. So now that's playing through my monitor speakers. So you can select where you want the sound coming through, whether it's your headset, your desk speakers, or the tablet. So yeah, that's how you can set up your tablet as a second PC monitor using a USB cable. If you wanna know how you can do this wirelessly, check out this video here. Thanks for watching.